Huh? I think you are able to see that uh, knot. So what you have to do is, you have to put this needle. See that needle which comes outside. See that needle. Put that needle inside the knot, and just so do it like that. The needle has a small notch in front of it. Once it goes into the knot, it ties, goes into the galapa neurotica and it gets transplanted there. See here, just go inside, see the hair transplanted, so simple like that. See the transplanted hair, go correctly into the loop, that is it, simple. So this is the way we transplant. Do a test graft and then go in for this. That will give a good result. Otherwise, we will end up with problems. You lo lose one patient, you are going to lose one street. You are going to lose four patients, you have to vacate the center there. So, be careful. Now we will go in for a hair transplant regular. See the position of the patient which will make us, either you can go in for a strip graft, I will demonstrate you strip graft, punch graft, I am just going to take two punches, I am going to take a small strip, otherwise what normally I advise is, there is a 1 mm graft, 1 mm punch, this will take maybe 1 to 2 hairs, this is also very simple, right, this is also very simple, instead of going in for a strip graft where there is going to be a heptic bleed, where we have to go in for a suture, this will be very simple. See this, this is going to be a 3 mm graft, this is going to be a uh, 1 mm graft. This you can go in for a regular punch grafting, where you need lots of hair, one. Here is one single, where you need only single hair. In the margins, in the peripheries, we go in for a single hair. In the vertex, in the center, we just go in for a punch craft. Either we can use a motor punch or we can use a hand punch. Both are going to be yield the same result. The only thing for a speed, motor punches are going to be, the procedure can be completed very fastly. This uh, hand punch, it will take time. What normally I advise is, you can go in for around 120 punches. A 4 mm punch will have around 8 to 10 hairs, of which 80 to 90 percentage will grow, that is around 8 hairs. So, 8 hairs, 120 punches, 1000 hairs sitting, finished. Same way, single hair, you can take a strip, cut it into few hairs, uh, strips, and then implant. That is single hair uh, grafting. The third one which we are doing now is a worm graft. We take a strip, we take a strip, same way we cut there in the recipient area, implant that strip inside. Instead of cutting that strip, instead of dissecting that strip into uh, follicles, we can transplant it directly. That will give a good result. The only thing there will be a little amount of bleed. I will demonstrate that also. That is so simple, the only thing we do not have a stripper now, a stripper comes with three blades. So, you strip, there will be a fine strip there, three strips. With that, you can transplant it directly here. Now, I am going to start the punches. See the angle, I am coming from behind, right, from downwards to upwards. Right, this is punch. I am just going to demonstrate two now. See the punch. Next one will be a strip graft. I think you are able to see that uh, margin. Since I do not have a stripper, I am using a blade for the strip.